August 1-6, 2021, the morning moon wanes toward its new moon phase in the eastern sky. It passes the bright stars that are prominent in the evening sky during the winter season in the northern hemisphere. The stars have been making their first appearances in the morning sky during summer. At this hour, Procyon and Bright Sirius are the last stellar duo to appear. Chart Caption, 2021, August 1-6, to the waning moon appears farther eastward each morning as the bright stars make a beautiful backdrop. By Jeffrey L. Hunt During August 1-6, to August 6, 2021, the waning moon appears in the eastern sky about an hour before sunrise. Each morning, notice its change from its previous morning's place and moon phase. Step outside each morning about an hour before sunrise. Here's what to look for. August 1st, the thick crescent moon, 42% illuminated, is over halfway up in the sky in the east-southeast. The gibbous moon is nearly 13 degrees to the right of the Pleiades star cluster, the Seven Sisters. August 2nd, the crescent moon, 33% illuminated, is less than halfway up in the east. It is to the right of a line from the Pleiades star cluster to Aldebaran, the brightest star in Taurus. August 3rd, this morning's crescent moon, 24% illuminated, is 5.9 degrees to the upper left of Aldebaran. August 4th, the waning moon, 16% illuminated, seems to be caught between the horns of Taurus, Elnath, the one budding with horns, and Zeta Tauri. The lunar slice is 4.9 degrees to the lower right of Elnath and 3.0 degrees to the upper left of Zeta. The two stars are too far apart for the moon and the stellar horns to fit into the same field of a binocular. The lunar crescent and Zeta Tauri make a nice sight through the binocular. August 5th, in Gemini this morning, the thinning moon is 3.0 degrees to the upper left of Tehat posterior, the heel, and 3.2 degrees to the upper right of Mebsutta, the outstretched paw of the lion. This morning all three celestial sites fit into a binocular field. Notice that Castor, one of the Gemini twins, is 15.7 degrees to the lower left of the moon. August 6, the moon, 5% illuminated, is about 10 degrees up in the east-northeast, 5.6 degrees to the upper right of Pollux, the second Gemini twin. With the sunrise time becoming noticeably earlier, viewing the morning and evening sky is easier than mornings and evenings near the solstice. As the midpoint of summer approaches, note the bright stars in the morning sky and the waning crescent moon as it heads toward the sunrise point during these six mornings.